about a year ago I did a video called a look at our setup it's actually a year and one day ago and I showed you guys what we used for DJing and I've gotten more cases and some new lights and in this past week we upgraded to the JBL 515 XT's from the Harbinger HA120 the HA120 worked good and it held up for us but we needed a new system that would fulfill our needs more like for instance when we're in the gyms and the big dances the HA120 the sound from that got a little drowned out with all the kids dancing and screaming at the same time so in the next clip I'll show you what we have and I'll give you a little review of everything so here I have two Ariba cases AC125's and one AC160 and in the first AC125 I have an American DJ snapshot 2 high powered strobe it's 70 watt bulb in it I've never had to replace it you can go up to 16 flashes per second and I'm thinking about getting another one soon they're about like 60 or 70 dollars I also have in this case, let's see, oh yeah, the Venue Mini Laser. Now this thing only costs like 30 bucks. Sorry the battery's died and you didn't really miss anything. And this only costs about like 30 bucks. I got it a year ago. And I'd say it's, it's decent for beginners, but I sort of don't really have any use for it anymore, but it still has a little cool effect. So that's the first case. In the second case, I have my uh, homemade speaker stand covers. Actually, nope. Actually, yes, I do. I have the cable for the Revo 4, a little informational thing I put on the front of our table. I'm covering up the phone number since this is going on YouTube. So, yeah, here's the homemade speaker stand covers. I didn't want to pay a hundred dollars for the Scrim King brand but I will at some point it's just that those work for me now and so the backup power cord I have the American DJ hold on I have the American DJ Revo 4 and it has like 200 and like I think 84 little LEDs in there. Yeah, you can see it. See the whole rows of them. And this is DMX and it has preset programs, but I always use Sound Active since I don't have a DMX controller. And it's really bright too. So that's the second case. And oh yeah, here's the second speaker stand. In the AC160, I have my little business cards on the top. I have the power cord, the tablecloth, and the American DJ Mystic. Now, I really like this light, and I'm definitely getting another one pretty soon. This is also DMX, but I just use Sound Active again. We just had a dance this Friday, and I kept the stuff in the cases since we have another party this this Thursday. And in the right here is the Odyssey FC mix deck case, and so I obviously have a mix deck in it. And in this box right here, I have miscellaneous wires, extension cords. Oh yeah, and the microphones. I ordered a new mic, but it's not here yet. This one is also good for beginners, but once you have good a good sound system, it's sort of it's not good enough anymore. I have my homemade laptop stand to go in front of the case like that when I stack the top of the case on the bottom of it. It fits good. I'll show you that in another video. My toolbox, because everyone needs a toolbox for some stuff at your gigs. You never know what will happen. It's a wire box. I have my little stool. Six foot folding table. And right there is the homemade table topper. 
since they don't sell the DJ skirts ones anymore. Wanted to make my own. Here's the speaker stand bag. The on stage stand. They go for my Proline speaker stands. I don't think it matters what the model they are because they're just regular stands. And this is what we use for our main set of speakers is the JBL Eon 515 XTs. I see, yeah, the 13 inch MacBook Pro is my main laptop. My friend also uses his. And then this is our old sound system, the HA120. Here's the amp for that. Here's the backup laptop, the HP G71. This is our my older lighting controller, the PC100A by American DJ. Again, it works good, but you have to have run an extension cord from every light to your up to your truss, and that gets a pain. So I got the my friend got the Chevet SF something, and it's you know you put the you put the box on the truss, and then you run the data cable back to the box on your table. So this is an old box I don't use anymore. <laughs> Extra wires, you know, different kind of stuff. The old table stands, and then I have the Odyssey LT MTS1 Pro truss in here. I used the five foot one last week, so that's in the case. And then there's the other five foot section. I have two Odyssey LTP two tripods. One's not up right now. The other one is over there. And then this is the last thing that I have, the American DJ Mini Fog. It's only 400 watts, but it works good since I only use it at house parties since all the schools I do don't let you use don't let you use fog since it sets off fire alarms. And this is just a cool sign I found when we were on a, be a beach in Maine. Probably washed up from Ireland, I'm just making a guess. And that's pretty much all the stuff I have. My friend has two color strips, two Chevet color strip minis. One American DJ Jellyfish. He has the Venue min Mini Green Laser. I have the red one. And that's pretty much it. Yeah, I'm gonna hopefully be getting a Gala um, American DJ Galaxian 3D too soon.